You cannot be up here. Look what you're doing. You're knocking my houses over and everything. You cannot be up here. Look at with all my packages and stuff. Hey. <laughs> you have to get down. Excuse me, sir. He does not care. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my word. Are you serious? Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm coming to you in my Buffalo Sabres bathrobe. <laughs> I'm very comfortable and um, I'm going to just keep it real today. I have a ton of friend mail that um, I want to share with everyone, but we're going to do this a little bit different this time. I am going to do the super fast speed thing while opening and then I will show what was in the package and who sent it. That way the video won't last three hours. Um, also, I wanted to just update everyone. I went to the eye doctor yesterday and um, I did need to uh, get a new prescription uh, for my glasses, but it wasn't um, anything to uh, worry about. Um, it is not my eyes that are causing the problem or my glasses. I do not have glaucoma. I do have cataracts, though. Oh, I'm not happy about that at all. I mean, already, I'm only 56 and I have cataracts already. But no glaucoma, no macular degeneration. Um, you know, my eyes are otherwise um, quite healthy. So... Uh, it's definitely not my eyes. So, like I said, I believe the headaches are from my sinuses. I don't care what they say. I know how I feel. And actually, I feel much better today, you guys. The headaches are very, very mellow. And um, they feel like they may be going away. Um, my ears are plugged. You know, I still have the, the, the sinus pressure, but I know that that's what it's from. I'm going to go to the store tomorrow and buy some uh, sinus medicine and see if that works. Um, I do have to be very careful only having the one kidney on what I take. So we'll see what happens with that. But I am feeling much, much better today. Um, I'm just really mad because I wasn't able to participate in the collaboration that Nicole North Garden was doing. Um, it was an open invitation. Your top five, I think it was your top five favorite thrifted Christmas items. Because I just wasn't feeling up to it. But, anywho, uh, let's get into opening the friend mail. So, what I'm going to do is I am going to say who it's from, and then I'm going to fast forward through the opening. So, this first package is from my friend Maria, okay? So, I am going to uh, now fast forward. I got... A Christmas sweatshirt. Oh my God, this is awesome. <gasps> Look at this, you guys. 
I love this. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, look at all the kitties. This is perfect. I can wear this for work. I'm going to wear it when we have our little Christmas party, which is um, we're having it the 24th. I love this. Thank you so much, Maria. Oh, my word. Look at that. That's awesome. Okay, that is fabulous. I'm going to put it right here, and we're going to move on to the next one. Um, let me come. I'm trying to get ones that I got a while ago. Let me... Let me go here. This one is from my friend David. I believe his YouTube name is D Dog. <laughs> I'm going to push this out just a little bit, guys. The camera's going to shake. Okay. My buddy D Dog, and he lives in uh, Wichita, Kansas. Oh, my goodness. What the heck was that? The cat. All right. It's back to fast forward mode. <laughs> okay, I have the box open. And first we're going to start off with a couple of Halloween goodies. He sent me these two cool Halloween decorations. Very, very cute. <laughs> I'm going to, I don't know where I'm going to put them. Uh, this is a very cool uh, plate. It's made in Holland. Very, very cool. Uh, there's, oh, I love purple. There's a really cool handmade hot pad love purple this reminds me of like the 60s <laughs> that's very very neat some vintage plastic holly leaves and berries and you know what um i may put this over here in my kitchen um behind my little snowman um yeah for some color great idea Cool, cool, cool. We have this very cool Halloween sign. It looks vintage, but it's not. But it's made to look vintage. I love that. That is very cool. We have this little butterfly. This I can hang up outside. Very pretty. I have some metal uh, garden signs that I can hang this from. Oh, these are transfer things. If I'm not mistaken, you, let me see. Yeah, you um, lay these on top and then you um, use a, uh, oh, what's that thing called? Oh, not a bone, um, but you guys know what I mean. It's a, a long, flat, it's not sharp, and you lay the thing and you, you burnish. You burnish this, and it transfers onto whatever item you want to transfer it to. Um, so these are cool. We have some ivy, and then we have some Christmas. Oh, these are cool. Look at these. Very cool. Oh, look. Valentine's, I would say. Oh, look at. These are very cool. Very, very, very cool. Love those. Oops, I dropped one. Uh, 
Ah, uh, let's see what else. There's paper here. Oh, we got a wind chime. Oh, this is cool. Hang on, because he's stuck on. <laughs> there it is. Oh, look at, oh, I think that butterfly must go on here. It's a little tangled. I'll have to straighten it out, but, oh, this is cute. Yeah, I think that butterfly must go on here somewhere. Yeah. It's got to go on there somewhere. Very cool. I love wind chimes. I have them all over my front porch in the summertime. Um, <laughs> look at this. Look at this dude. How cool is that? That's got to be like from the 60s or 70s. He is very cool. Oh my God. His little ears. <laughs> That's cool. All right. We have some stuff in bubble wrap, but it's not going to be hard to open. So we don't have to go to the fast forward mode. <gasps> oh! He said, he, I think he needs a face painted on. Look at, oh, I know these are, um, these are like from the seventies. Love it. Very cool. I could paint a face on there. Okay, I'm going to speed up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to open all of the bubble wrap and then we'll come back and I'll show you what's inside. Wow, that took a while. <laughs> OMG, you guys, wait till you see the stuff that he sent me. Okay, so <laughs> let's have a little sip of the coffee. Mm-hmm. Okay, first of all, let me just say, David, you are awesome. I am, I, I am beyond grateful that you would do this for me. And I just, I would never be able to thank you enough. As to all of my subscribers, my friends, um, whether you send me things or not, um, I am very grateful for every one of you. So let me just say that. Okay, so let me show you this. Look at these very cool vintage gift tags. Love these. Then he sent me these very cool um, mini Christmas lights. I can't believe, you know, I still like these lights. I really, really do. And a lot of times I use these. Oh, by the way, these are cheater glasses that I'm wearing right now because I had to leave my glasses there because I want the new lenses put in my existing frames. So anyways, they're, they're kind of like bothering me a little bit. But anyways, um, I like to put these on wreaths and stuff like that. So these will come in very handy. Woolworths. Oh, my word. Woolworths. I got this very pretty 
milk glass. Uh, it's either, uh, to me, it could be either a toothpick holder or a votive candle holder. It's very pretty. You can see it's really thin on the top here. Love that. He sent me a set of bunny salt and pepper shakers. These will be perfect for uh, spring and Easter. Beautiful. He sent me this little mini oil lamp. How cute is that? This would look cute in my bathroom, actually. You guys saw this little little ghosty. He's so cute. Look at this, you guys. OMG. Remember those? I remember these, and especially with the dark blue background. I love this. This is going in my living room. I love them. <laughs> um, he sent me these and asked me to send them to Joanne at a work in progress. These little tiny taper candles. So I will absolutely do that for you, um, David. No problem. He sent me this little note on strawberry paper. <laughs> That's great. Got these little white doves for crafting. I might be able to use these um, in my daughter's wedding decor somehow. So we'll see. <clears throat> Excuse me. We've had some very crazy weather today. Uh, let me just tell you. It was raining torrential rain all day long. And as of about maybe an hour ago, it is now snowing like the Dickens. So I don't know. Uh, I got this very cool ornament, handmade. That's very cool. As a matter of fact, these came off. I have to put them back on. But one goes on this side and one goes on this side. So we could fix that. That's an easy fix. He sent me some very cool vintage glitter. It looks, it looks older. Um, this old candle holder. These usually came with a very ornate pillar candle. And it usually was either like um, a Christmas scene, like the wise men on the candle, or Mary and the baby Jesus, something like that. Um, that came, uh, with this. Very cool. I, and the reason I know is because I saw one at, uh, Goodwill the last time I was there. So these are, I like this. This is cool. And I have a candle I can put in here, actually. He sent me this magnet for my refrigerator. That's very cool. This is like a, um, a clear resin. You can tell from the back. That is so cute. And I do have a bunch of Christmas magnets on my fridge. I am going to get this uh, Christmas tour, home tour done for you guys. So um, I'm working on it. Got this very cool wooden ornament. He's cute. We have a very old, I don't know, I wonder if this is Bakelite light switch cover. It's got some pretty cool details. It might be. I um, I can't remember how you tell if it's Bakelite or not. If anybody knows, let me know. It's something about rubbing it and if it smells or something. Like, I don't know, but. Anywho, he sent me this very cool mold. It's metal. It's 
what it looks like on the outside. And it sits, it'll sit upright. Um, this is a, uh, oh, oh, this is cool. This is a spice um, holder for paprika, but it looks like a book. How cool is that? Westwood Products, made in Japan. That's very cool. And it has like the windmill on there. That's cool. I like that. This could go on one of my tiered trays. And then he sent me this set of little vintage lanterns. Um, I think these go on the Christmas tree because they have little holes in the bottom. I think that the lights might go inside of. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, David, because I'm really not sure, but that's what it looks like to me. So those are cool. He sent me this very cool glass bake little ramekin. Love that design on there. I know it's kind of hard to see. And I use these a lot when I'm cooking and baking. <laughs> Joy Juice. Eureka Springs. Is this APK? No, Arkansas. I think that's supposed to be Eureka Springs, maybe Arkansas, but it looks like APK to me. Look at this. That is hilarious. Hey, Ma. Hey, Paul. <laughs> that is adorable. I love that. How cute is that? Ma is smoking a pipe. I wonder what's in that pipe she's smoking. <laughs> He sent me a few Avon pieces. Oh my God, this is so cool. This one had um, to a wild rose cologne in it. And this is supposed to be a spool of thread and the thimble. And then we have a kitty with a ball of yarn. This had cologne in it as well. This had... Um, honeysuckle in it, and I love to smell. Oh, you can still smell it. Oh, my word, I love it. Let me see the honeysuckle. Oops, the little thing came off. That smells fabulous. Oh, I wonder, I wish they still made that. I don't think they do, but that smells really good. Even after all these years, it smells delicious. Oh, that's not a word you usually use for cologne, but that smelled delicious. And then he sent me this. Oh, look at this. I think also came with a little bowl that it sat in. Maybe not. I could be wrong, but... I know it had strawberry uh, bubble bath or something in it. I can't smell it anymore, but yes, I love it. He sent me these very, very awesome ornaments. Look at these, you guys. How cool are those? And they are all um, the nativity scene. There's five of them. These are very cool. These are uh, made in China. But, yeah, these are going to go on my tree. Beautiful. Um, he sent me a couple of... I love these magazines. We had these magazines at work for the residents. The good old days. I remember those feety pajamas. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, I love these magazines. I, and the reminiscing magazines as well. They have some fabulous um, pictures in here. And stories. And they're just, I love them. 
Um, so thank you for these. I'm going to have a lot of fun flipping through these. And he also sent me a um, Rare Recipes and Budget Savers book. Uh, there's no cover on it. Um, it's from Wichita, Kansas, where, where David is from. Uh, copyright 1961. And it has all different kinds of like recipes. Black George cake. Oh, sugar, dark molasses, butter, egg yolk, flour, cinnamon, cloves, soda, salt, and boiling water. And then it has a filling of one cup of ground raisins, a cup of sugar, and four tablespoons of water. Um... I don't think I would care for that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it would have been good, but I think you could, like, you know, pass on the filling. Yeah. Italian rum cake. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to have to look through this. Um, He sent me these very cool gold seals these are awesome love these we have um ah we have bells we have um the holly and the berries we have a santa and we have a stocking. And then these are more um, like, uh, they re remind me of uh, Mandela. Very, very cool. But I have to say my favorite thing in this box. Oh my God. Are these vintage die cuts? Ah! <laughs> OMG! David! Oh my goodness! These are phenomenal! Oh, I never can find vintage Halloween. Thank you so much. Oh, these are phenomenal. These are made by, it looks like C-O-P-R period, H-E, and then it's Lures, L-U-H-R-S. I don't know if you guys can see that because I know it's not going to focus. And then this one just says Made in the USA. Oh my God. So that whole box of goodies was from my friend, David. David, thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Fabulous box of goodies. Okay, I have many more to go. So let me pause the video for a second and then I will open up the next box. Okay, guys, um, I also, I forgot to tell you that I did get cards. Um, I got a card from David in his package and a card from Maria in her package, but I'll read those later. So, um, I also received a beautiful um, card from uh, another uh, Maria, who is my friend, um, a Get Well card. So um, I wanted to, to say thank you to her. Um, it brought tears to my eyes. And um, this came all the way from Sweden. So uh, Maria, 
thank you so very much. You are a you are a joy and you are a sweetheart. Thank you, honey. It's right here. All right. So next I have a package from Jonathan. And he is from um, New York. Yeah. All right, Jonathan. From New York. And I already opened it up. There is a card in here. Um, and I'll read that later as well. So let me see what is in here. is the salt and pepper shakers that my mom gave me. Oh my God. Jonathan. Oh my God. And this is Holt Howard. 1959. Oh my God, Jonathan, thank you. This is absolutely phenomenal. Oh my God, it's just beautiful. I can't stop looking at it. Look at that, gore. look at that face, you guys. And it's a little planter. Jonathan, I just can't express my gratitude. Um, you know, it's it's the things that are from, you know, your childhood or, you know, that are the most important. And um, this, um, I mean, it goes with those salt and pepper shakers of my mom's. I just can't even believe it. And I just, I just cannot thank you enough. I, I just can't. It's, I want to, I just want to see his card really quick. Wow. Beautiful card. Look at this card. Okay, first of all, I cannot read. <laughs> this person's name that shared this with me is not Jonathan. Wow. These cheater glasses <laughs> are definitely not working. Her name is Iona May. Not Jonathan. Oh my goodness. Iona, I am so sorry. I am so glad I opened this card. Oh dear. I hope you don't mind if I read this because it's just amazing to me. Uh, Dear D, I am sending you one of my angels. I saw how excited you were with your mom's angels. You could put her between your two. With some holly, it has been in my family for a long time. I am getting older and I want her to have a happy home. Hugs, Iona May. You know what, Iona? She's not going to have, or could she have, a happier home than this one. And I am just 
so touched. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Jessica, look at you saw those the salt and pepper shakers grandma gave me there, the little angels on the thing there. Yeah. Look at I gotta show my daughter. This matches. Oh really? Oh snap. What do you put in it? It's a little plant. A planter. Oh, a planter? Yes. That's oh, cute. Isn't it beautiful? Mm -hmm. It's from 1959. It's cute. I feel like if you put something small in there too, like even if you made it like a toothpick holder. Right. Or something like that. Mm hmm But she matches those, the two that are out there that grandma gave me. And it's a whole towered. I don't know what that means, but it's very cute. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Well, now that I used up about 15 minutes on this gorgeous angel from someone that I thought was Jonathan, but it's actually Iona. I'm so sorry, Iona. Oh my goodness. That is just amazing. All right. Next, I have a gift from Teresa, and she's from California, Turlock, California, to be exact. And she included a note on here. Oh, dear. D, I found these vintage mice knee huggers at the Goodwill bins. I find them eerie like clowns, but I knew they had to be vintage. I just have them put away in a box, so I decided to send them to you and Binks to keep or resell. I subscribe to you and Jessica's channel. Oh, awesome. Um, perhaps it's time for Binks to start his channel. <laughs> you got that right. As you can tell, I'm a big Binks fan. You take care, D, Teresa. Okay. Binks, yeah, you saw him at the beginning of the video. As soon as I put the camera on the tripod on the table, he jumped up and you saw the rest. Yeah. He is something else. All right. Let me see what is in here. I'm very excited to see these. Sorry about the crinkling of the paper. It's inevitable when you're open. Oh, my word. Those are cute. Oh, look at these. Are they mice elves? They're little mice. Oh, made in Japan. My favorite place. Yes. Look at, oh my gosh. I have never, ever seen these before. These are amazing, Teresa. Oh my word. Look at, they got little... They have little pipe cleaner tails. Oh my gosh. That's one packet. Now here's another one. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Look, you guys. more yes it's like a whole family all new material look it says japan there's the little sticker oh these are awesome Teresa. oh my god thank you so much i will cherish these forever i really really will these are fantastic I have to hang these up someplace. I'm going to, you know what? I, I know I can fit them on my tree somewhere. I'm going to try. I am going to try. Oh, Teresa, thank you. 
Oh my God, these are awesome. I have never seen mice knee huggers ever. Oh my goodness, those are fabulous. Wow. My goodness. Oh. Ice coffee. I love ice coffee. All right. This is a very long video anyway, even though I'm fast forwarding to open things. I have a gift from um, my buddy Larry. Frog Larry. I wasn't going to open the cards and read them, but you know what? I'm on a roll, so I might as well. Wishing you the beauty, the quiet beauty of a peaceful holiday season. May your heart be light and your holidays be bright. Could not get these pieces on the first box, hence the second one. <laughs> Hope you will enjoy these items. Um, again, from your Out West YouTube pal, Larry. I'm sure I will enjoy them, Larry. I love everything that you send me, so. Oh, I didn't even show you guys the card. Look how gorgeous that is. Love cardinals. They are just beautiful birds. All right, we have lots of bubble wrap and plastic bags. Um, all right, well, let me get everything out. And you know what? This is not this is not going to be bad, guys. I won't even have to fast forward. Nope. Okay. Let me let me just double check. I want to make sure that nothing gets thrown out. All right, we are good in that department. Put that over there. All right, so. <gasps> Eeyore, he is actually, he should have a ring here. He's probably like a keychain or something. Um. But I do have uh, jump rings because I do make jewelry. So I can hook him up. I love him. He is adorable. Press on the bump on his left. Oh. Oh my word. He's a flashlight. How awesome is that? Oh, I love it. I thought something felt like, you know, thank you for including instructions because I would have been like, what the heck? All right. Oh, how cute are these? Hang on, guys. Let me get these out. Oh, these are adorable. Save a turkey, eat chicken. <laughs> Little shelf sitter, he's cute as I'll get out. Then we have this adorable little piggy. How cute is he? <laughs> this is made, what is this? Masonchance.org. I know, it's not going to focus. I, I don't know. I hate this phone. I really do. It really aggravates me. All right. And it looks, oh boy. Oh, 
coffee and cat hair. I never leave home without them. Boy, ain't that the truth. Holy crap. This is awesome, Larry. I absolutely love this, and I am hiding this from my son, or I will never see it again. It will go into the great abyss called his room and his vehicle, and I will never see it again. That is awesome. Larry, thank you. <laughs> oh, that is great. That is great. <laughs> All right. I have another box. Oh, my word. Now... Um, this box is from my friend, Diane. Yep, I just want to make sure. Uh, it's from my friend, Diane. And I already cut into it and, and opened it up. I'm going to actually set it over here on the chair where I can get at it. Oh. All right. So we have, <laughs> Cat Mama, absolutely. I'll be hiding this as well, or I will never see it again either. I love it, love it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at this cuteness. Oh, I love this. Fantastic. Absolutely love it. <laughs> All right. What week do we hit? Oh my gosh. Look at this, you guys. Okay, you know what? There's a card in here. Let me read it really quick. I just saw it sitting in the side there. Oh, look at this. Is this like not the perfect um, card for me? Hi, Dee. Just a little note to say thanks for all the great videos. Hope you can use what I sent, Diane. Well, you know I will. I sure will. Oh, look at this, you guys. <laughs> that is adorable. Now, this has a little chip, but I know I could touch that up with no problem. I have so many different colors of paint that that is not a big deal. I love it. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? Oh, how cute. Okay, wait. I just want to make sure that I got everything out of here. And I did. Look at how cute is this? It looks just like you, Binks. Mm -hmm. Put a little candle in there. Oh, that is adorable. I love it. Look at that face. Yep, that's Binks. Absolutely. <laughs> Diane, thank you. These are great great items. I love everything. Like I said, I'll be hiding these cups. Yeah. I'll never see them again. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Wow. Yep. Got my pajamas on underneath. All right. I have a box here. 
I'm gonna fast forward so I can get everything opened up. Okay, well, I forgot to put that on, uh, you know, fast motion and uh, <laughs> it is what it is. Um, so this gift, this friend mail is from um, my friend Jeannie. So I have everything opened up here and I'm just gonna pull it out and see what we have. Oh, how adorable is this little guy? <gasps> Look! Oh, my goodness. He's got popcorn shrapnel on his butt. <laughs> Look at how beautiful he is. Oh my gosh, Jeannie, thank you. I love him. That's like my Binks. <laughs> Who's down here digging in the popcorn? Yes, he is. We have a card as well. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at this card. <laughs> um, she says, D, hoping the holidays bring you heavenly peace and a healthy new year. Hugs and love, Jeannie. She says, I just want you to know how much I really enjoy your videos. You are so much fun. I feel like I'm sitting at the other end of your table. I also love when Binks, your black cat, cuts into the video with the swing tail. <laughs> yes. So when I saw this, I just had to get it and send it to you. Well, Jeannie, thank you so very much for thinking of me. That's just fantastic. I, I'm like so touched. Thank you very much. Oh my goodness. Oh, yes. Thanks has quite a fan club. Absolutely. All right. Fast forward mode again. All right. Now this, uh, this package is from my friend Alex from Chapter 2 Vintage Company. If you guys haven't seen her channel, please check her out. She has a fantastic channel. She does um, the thrifting and the, the haul videos and decor and crafts. You'll love her. I will link her um, in the description box. So this is from her and it says, D, open me first. So let's follow directions. Oh, look at that beautiful card. It says, D, Merry Christmas. I saw this. I, I saw this. I saw this and knew it had to belong to you. Put it under your tree to open Christmas Day. Love you, Alex. Wishing you all the merry moments and jolly joys of the season. Oh my God, Alex, you're making me wait until Christmas to open it? That is just not fair. Not fair, not fair. All right, I guess I will wait. It's got, <laughs> it says, <laughs> it was this or socks. And look at this wrapping paper. <laughs> I love it. Oh my God. And guess what? I know that I had the movie Christmas Vacation, and now I cannot find it. So I, I ordered it the other day off eBay, and it came in the mail the other day. So I'm going to watch it tonight. Yes, I am. I love that movie. Yep. I love me some Clark Griswold. <laughs> All right, Alex. I guess I'll have to wait. You know I'm going to sit there and stare at it now for two weeks. 
or a week and a half, whatever it is. Okay. I have one final package to open, and it is really, really large. So, oh, and you know what? I forgot, too. David also sent me um, this tea towel, that uh, flower sack towel, tea towel, um, the ones that I love that are really absorbent. This was covering everything that was in the box. I forgot to show you guys. All right. Okay. Now, this gift, holy cow, is from my very, very dear friend, um, Shannon. Um, she is the one that we all prayed for um, who had breast cancer. So, uh, she sent me this and she had sent me an email asking me if I had received it yet. She was so worried that, um, you know, I wasn't going to get it and she wanted me to be able to enjoy it for Christmas. So I went to the post office yesterday at lunch and I picked up all my packages that were there. So this was one of them. All right, let me open it. I could fast forward, but I don't think this is going to be um, in need of a fast forward because it's not. Um, ah! It's not. Um, I forgot what I was trying to say. Never mind. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on guys, because there's a card in here. <laughs> Have a perfect Christmas. Oh, I, I don't know if, um, I sent, um, I sent Shannon, um, this gorgeous angel, not an angel, it's a Mother Mary, um, pendant that I had thrifted, and I also, uh, sent her, um, an angel, I, you know what, it was quite a while ago, so I, I'm trying to remember exactly what I sent. Now I can't think, but anyways. Um, she said, my dearest D, when I commented on your video about how beautiful that angel was, I never thought it would be in my lap the next day. This was... Um, an angel figurine that I had thrifted that she's referring to. This was quite a ways back, like a long while back. Um, you are so very special to me. I could never express into words what or how much your friendship means to me. Thank you also for the necklace. It is absolutely stunning. I wear it every day. I made this wreath for you. It took me a while because I have horrible arthritis in my hands. I hope you like it. I wanted to get it to you sooner, but I couldn't find a darn box. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. My New Year's resolution is to get my butt to Niagara Falls and meet you. Oh, I love you to the moon and back, Shannon. Oh, Shannon, that would be so awesome. Oh my God, you guys, wait till you see this wreath. This is gorgeous. You guys, look. Isn't this beautiful? Oh, Shannon. 
Hi, Shannon. <laughs> oh, this is just gorgeous. You did such a beautiful job. And you made it just for me. And it's just beautiful. Oh my God, look at that, you guys. Just gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Shannon, let me just say that Binks is in the box that you looked for for how long? to mail this wreath. <laughs> so he's enjoying the box as well. <laughs> but um, let me just say to you that this is a very special gift to me because someone um, that has arthritis knows how painful it is. And for you to force yourself to make this for me goes beyond words. And I just want you to know that I will cherish this for the rest of my life. This will be up in my house every Christmas. And I want you to know that my Christmas wish is to be able to meet you as well. So I hope that at some point in my lifetime that I will be able to meet you. Um, just gorgeous. So guys, on this note, I'm going to say thank you so much for joining me. Thanks for being patient with me um, as I'm going through my own issues. And um, I'll catch you soon. Bye for now.